summer begins and getting cool in summer heat with you, my sweet. Sitting in the back of your car, wishing for this road to take us far. Now I've been away too long. I'm going home. Good afternoon, everybody. I sure hope that you enjoyed that ride as much as I did down to the beautiful town of Point Reyes Station, located directly on the San Andreas Fault and the uh, Tamales Bay. It is spectacular down here. Many of you probably have a place in your neighborhood or a place in your city, maybe outside of town, maybe uh, hundreds of miles away, which is kind of your touchstone place of feeling good and getting yourself regrounded when times are tough like they are now during this uh, COVID-19 pandemic and times of social unrest. I live, of course, in a very crowded urban neighborhood, constant horns blaring and constant noise, car alarms. But when I come to a place like Point Ray Station, it's about as opposite an atmosphere as I can possibly find. And maybe that's why I love it. Maybe that's why I've come here so many times over the past years. It is my great escape. So I'll be poking around town a little bit. I'm going to go over to the Palace uh, Market here, grab something to eat, and then we'll, uh, we'll poke around town a little bit. It's a big boy. Got the uh, local ham and Swiss on rye with uh, mustard. I just like the whole feel of that place. Everything is like mom and pop that they stock in there for the most part. I mean, you have sodas and things, but they have uh, all the local cheeses. This is a great cheese making area down here and local cured meats makes it pretty special. Let's go tie on the feed bag. Big sandwich, big sandwich. This should keep me going for a while today. Pardon the little bouncing there, it's a little windy, 70 degrees, delightful. There it is, how's that, uh, how's that look for fully loaded? Yum, yum. Mm. 
great. Flavorful ham, Swiss. Woo! a big biker town I didn't well I do now I can understand why as beautiful as the area is around here the open road I hate to eat alone. Yeah, I fed him. <laughs> this is Toby's of Point Ray Station, kind of an informal place to hang out. They used to have picnic tables around. But with the uh, COVID-19, they pulled all them, but uh, the feed store, hardware, lumber, general store. Let's go check it out. They got everything in here, even an art gallery. Lumber and art together. There's 
liberal places and then there's uh, liberal places. Somebody went into the store with a uh, MAGA hut. Uh, Make America great again. I'm surprised they didn't get uh, thrown out. I bet in this whole town, in a very liberal county of Marin County, this would probably be a place where you'd be hard pressed to find one registered Republican. And a lot of the old line hippies from the uh, 60s settled here. Let's keep looking around. They have this enormous old depot here. Part of it's being used as a visitor center, but the architecture is really something on it. A big old time transfer station. Got some nice history of the old train coming through town. Kind of a faded pick, but you can see the same hotel today, right over there. Almost the uh, same same depot, minus well, these I guess these arches are still part of it here. This is an unusual place here. This is the oldest contracted AAA station in the nation, 1923. First one in the nation for AAA when it when it just the oldest still active AAA. Oh. 1923. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Been in business since the 20, well, 1920 something. It says, yeah, that, that's the AAA, not the garage or anything. The AAA. Wow. But then the, the garage is four, four generations now old. How about all the? Uh, These guys are all uh, all the previous owners, the, the old guys that are all dead now, you know, some of these date back to the 1950s here, there was dates <laughs> on them, and then uh, these are fallow here that were from the point out here when it was legal to uh, hunt. hunt them out there. Thanks for your time today, yeah. very fascinating. <laughs> mm. Looks like some parts from 1923 too, huh? Beautiful day, 70 degrees, just absolutely perfect.
impromptu street dancing here. <laughs> Like I told you guys, a very colorful place. <laughs> Individualism, right? Uniqueness. It's what makes Point Ray Station so great. There's the Palace Market. I highly recommend this. If you're in town, definitely make a stop at the Palace Market. Their ice cream is supposed to be incredible. I believe I had it before. The soft ice cream was delicious. And if you like authentic local groceries, cheeses, wines, this is the place to go to. Not cheap, but definitely cool. I've talked about uh, local cheeses quite a bit here, and I know this will appeal to my friend Insane Chef who knows this uh, as a cheese making area here in Marin County and probably the best well known is the Cowgirl Creamery so let's see if that's open today let's see if we can go in and check it out well unfortunately they're not open on the inside unless you're an employee but uh, you can order on the outside here. I'll tell you, it's well worth having some of the local cheese. Kind of disappointing, but that's part of what I call the degraded uh, travel experience. And you're going to find that a lot across the, uh, a lot of the U.S. now. But what can you do? Let's go check out some more of the uh, street scenes here. I also mentioned the San Andreas early on in Tamales Bay. If you look at a map of the San Francisco Bay Area, Marin County, north of the Golden Gate Bridge, you'll see a little bay with a triangular piece of land, and that's actually part of the San Andreas Fault, a really major fault that split part of the land mass off and created the uh, bay. And if you have a chance to go back and see some of the earlier travel videos that Missy Jen and I did in 2015-16, you can see our trip to the earthquake trail where they actually have this fence that was moved 14 feet as the earth uh, shifted it cut in two and shifted in two parts. Pretty amazing. But this is definitely, definitely the heart of earthquake country. But I'll tell you, across some of these meadows and these low ridges the views are just breathtaking You ever seen so many abalone shells? <laughs> Remember what I said about unique individuals? Here's another place I really recommend to eat, the Side Street Kitchen. They do a great job with chicken. I had breakfast here. It was amazing. The prices were real good too. You should definitely check it out if you're here. Can I tell you, a cool little town, huh? Got everything here. Everything you could possibly want. Great retreat. Only about uh, 40 minutes away from the rancho and a world uh, park. Let's finish up with a little uh, cinematic outro here of Point Reyes.